Hello everybody, welcome to Project Beauty, where we talk about project panning and everything beauty related. My name is Jen. Totally forgot to plug in my light. There we go. Uh, I want to update you guys on the Pans of Life, which was created by Jaylon and some of her college friends. Hello Patrick. Um, this one's from March 8th of 2024 to March 8th of 2025, and it is a project around 80s sitcoms. And you set your own goals and it updates on the 8th of each month. So for the first item I have or the first prompt I have is night court which is something you wear at night and I brought in the Ulta Beauty Watermelon Fresh Sleeping Mask and this one was gifted to me from Kim from Teacher Loves Beauty and as you can see I've gotten a really good amount of use on this already. I love this. It smells like watermelon. Oh my god it's so good and I want more of this. I would love to see if I could get another one of these picked up for me. But I checked the Ulta website and I did not see this on there. So I kind of freaked out because this is really good. I like it a lot. So I'm going to have to get someone to have a gander and see if they can find it for me because um, I did not see it. And oh my gosh, that sucks. But I would love to complete that because it's really good. The next item is for Full House, which is your fullest category. And I have brought in the Tarte Precious Gems Cheek Palette, but I haven't used it yet still. Because I have so much going on for cheeks and highlight and all that stuff, I haven't touched it yet. So I will eventually get to that. I was just working through a couple other things to get uses on to get it rolled out. Um, and then we have the Golden Girls, which is golden packaging. And for that, I brought in this Jouer Cheek Tint. And I have not used it more than last time because I've been using, again, other cream products. This is very lackluster. Also, you guys know April was a write-off for me. I was very sick. My family was very sick. Family health issues. It was just, yeah. So we're just going to move on. Um, the next item is for Who's the Boss? I am skipping over a couple because I'm only talking to you guys about mostly the ones that I have used throwing in a few other extra ones but who's the boss woman-owned brand and I brought in the ABH Sun Idol highlighter which I have now used three times and I want to use it 10 and you can see there's a little bit of usage there at the top corner there but I haven't used it exactly as much as I want to but I love the compartment or the compact of this compartment it's just such a nice compact it's heavy it's like weighted it's beautiful i love the color of this i love the i just it's nice it's really nice it feels luxury and i'm here for that uh, but i want to use it the seven more times so i need to get my button gear but i have so much highlighter that i'm using so i have a highlighter that i'm trying to pan actually two in one that i'm trying to pan or at least hit pan this year i have another highlighter that i'm trying to hit pan on and i have other ones that i'm just trying to get usage goals on not including the ones in this project so it's yeah it's all good it's all good um the next one is for uh what do we want to go with three's company product in a trio and i brought in the mac face palette in pretty shiny things this is what it looks like and it has a highlighter a blush and a bronzer and i took this with me when i went on my work trip recently and i managed to get all my extra uses that i needed so i wanted to use this nine times and i ended up using it the nine times so that's perfect i had four last month and i used it five times on my work trip actually six so i have 10 uses but i used each of these twice which is six uses like six individual uses so that makes me so happy this can go back into my collection and that is really great. I enjoyed using that so much. Um, the next thing we have is the Silver Spoons, which is something you splurged on. And I brought in the Givenchy Prisme Libre Powder. And this is in Vol Rosé. And I wanted to use it 15 times, and I used it 15 times. There isn't much left, as you can see there's not much left in here and I have a full size now which is great um I do like the little tiny size for travel for whatever um just like small use I use this mostly under my eyes but I will put it back into my collection for now um and then next we have which one do I want to go with um okay so charles in charge takes care of your face or skin and that is my mac fix plus and i have used this up to 25 uses i actually thought i was going to get all 30 but because i was sick and because i was away for work 
I didn't use it as much so you can see I got a few more uses but nothing too too crazy I will make another line here but not as much as I did the last month probably half of the month before so I will mark that um, but I need five more uses in order to roll this out even though I'm going to continue using it and I'll probably bring it into another project then we have for um, the facts of life is broken out into four different like sub sub prompts and two of those are already completed so I have left Blair and Joe for Blair I have spoiled yourself with so something that's like you spoiled yourself which I brought in the Charlotte Tilbury pillow talk face palette and I do love the front kind of annoyed at the pillow talk name already like needs to come up with something a little more creative now because I think people are very tired of it um but I excuse me I have used this one a few more times and now I have a total of uh, eight for sorry four uses <laughs> out of eight oh my gosh my brain is starting to get away from me but I have four uses on this now and I need to continue my last use was on this blush right here and I need to start using it more because otherwise I'm like not going to be buying stuff like this in the future because I'm just not using the ones that I already have so I need to start playing with face palettes more um, and I need to also eventually it's not even half the year yet but eventually I'm going to need to figure out what face palette I want to pan next year so I need to see how this year goes how much success I have with the items that I've rolled in and then something like this may come into play next year we'll see I'm not sure but I definitely need to start being more aware of what I have and what I can bring in so I think and that's all I'm going to talk about I was going to talk about um Joe which is an edgy thing but I haven't used that item and then the small wonder which is something you apply robotically without thinking I have my Kosa Sport which I'm going to be honest I don't even know where that is and that's the only reason that I have not talked about it is because I thought I put it in my purse for my like my road trip. Oh I did it's in here it's just way in the bottom squished. Okay so this is my Kosa Sport lip balm in the shade Rush and it is kind of tinted so you can see it's got a little bit of color barely gives you any color. Let me roll this down and see where I'm at now. I haven't gotten a bunch of use but this thing is loaded with product so I need to get more use on this and it is very nice. I would definitely repurchase that. Um, it's on my wish list, but I also have like a ton of other lip balms that I need to get through first before I even consider bringing in more. So maybe 2025, but definitely not 2024. So that is everything. Please go check out Jaylon and anyone else who is doing this Fantastic Ladies collab. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a fabulous day. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye.